Hello, my name is Brad Barton, principal at Coppinville Junior High School. And I just want to say how excited we are to start a new school year, and we hope you are too. Here at Coppinville, we want all students to be successful. So what does it take to be successful? You must have a positive attitude in everything that you do. You have to take responsibility. You must have integrity. You've got to be determined, and you have to have a standard of excellence in your life. Hi, my name is David Miller. Welcome to Combo Junior High. This is a big school with many students, so a few guidelines have to be put in place for a pleasant atmosphere. Most of our students arrive and depart from Cottonville by bus or personal vehicle. We have a procedure to make this transition run smoothly. When you arrive, pull up as far as possible. Students report to the gym. Breakfast starts at 720. At dismissal, students who ride the bus are expected to go to the gym and sit in their assigned bus area. In the gym, students' voice level is zero, so everyone can hear the numbers of arriving buses. Also, there is no phone or headphones in the gym, so everyone can hear. No food, drink, or concessions is to be brought into the gym. Students who leave by car are supposed to go to the cafeteria. They are expected to find the first available seat. In the cafeteria, student voice level is zero so that everyone can hear their names when their ride has arrived. No food, drinks, phones, or earbuds are allowed while waiting in the cafeteria. Listen for your name to be called. And when it is called, exit to your ride with a quick pace. Everyone needs a break, and with break in mind, our students have a few options. Students this year will have indoor and outdoor break. If you choose indoor break, you can stay in A Hall, or you can stay in the Hall. Area. If you choose outside break, you must stay in the courtyard. When break ends, you go straight to your next class. Traffic in the hallways can be chaotic, but we have a plan in place that will help students get from place to place in a timely manner. To begin with, students are expected to put cell phones and earbuds away. Students are also expected to remove head coverings and keep to the right in the hallway. Hallways are divided in the middle by tape. And keep to the right in the hallway. Please keep to the right. Please keep to the right. No U-turn, no U-turn. Keep walking, walk and talk. Let's go, go to your class. Let's go. Emergency procedures are necessary. Students must be familiar with them, just in case. So let's consider fire drills and weather drills. We are about a conductive fire drill. In a fire drill, we exit the building. Everyone will walk to the right. Voice level zero, 
Listen for instructions from your teacher. This is Gordon. Teachers and students are now entering into our fire drill procedure. Exit the building to your designated locations. Thank you. We are about to practice a severe weather drill. In a severe weather drill, everyone reports to Hall C. Greetings to teachers, we have severe weather activity. Please proceed to the shelter. Voice level zero. Follow the teacher's instructions as to where to go. school year, go Eagles.